well, we were gonna go outside, but maybe not anymore. Hey guys, what's up? It's Matt Meadows here from Get Speed Back. Uh, I just wanted to make a quick video about uh, a few things, basically three things that, that I want us to focus on doing now moving forward. So the first one is I want to reiterate why we've been doing these videos. And the whole purpose behind me starting up this YouTube channel um, is because Every time you go online and you read about, um, you know, other, in my case, other SaaS companies, other SaaS founders building their products and their businesses, it's really difficult to get an idea of what someone is doing on a day-to-day -day basis and the sorts of decisions that they're having to make on a granular level. Um, as a quick example, people, people will say, oh, you know, we, we decided to do this in terms of marketing to, to try to get our first users or we're, we were leveraging these channels, but what does that mean? You know, what, what exactly are you doing on those channels to try to get those eyes on your product? What are you saying? How are you conveying that message? So I wanted to do this because I felt like there was a need for other people to um, learn by watching what someone else is doing, trying to build their own startup and their own business and their own company. So I wanted to be able to share the most detailed view of what we were trying to do to become successful. So that's what I wanna highlight every time I do one of these videos is making sure that I'm giving um, the clearest um, depiction of of what we're doing on that day to try to move our business forward. Hopefully that sort of information will be useful to other people who are trying to do similar things or um, are in a completely different space but are facing similar problems to what we're having. So I'm really just doing it to, to try to be helpful as well as organize sort of my thoughts as we're trying to figure things out. So that's one thing. The second thing is I briefly want to talk about um, this video on a more macro level of like the content that, that we're going to be um, creating. So um, a few months ago, I was, I was blogging, I was writing stuff every day, it got some good engagement online, but it was really more about our story. And I want us to continue to do that, but start to focus more on the types of problems that we're solving for people and how we're solving them. Because if I if I do that effectively, all that information can help eventually funnel back to our site, getting attention to our site and what we're doing, and work to convey why our product is a solution for specific people's problems. So there's general SEO value to be had, but I, I just want to make sure that we're doing it in a way um, that remains authentic. It is not this generic uh, sort of corporate bloggy stuff that you would see, but at the same time could be beneficial to, you know, someone who doesn't know about us coming and seeing what we're talking about and seeing the connection between um, their problems and, and our solution. So in general, sort of upping our content, being a little bit more frequent and purposeful with our content, making sure that we're um, properly communicating between different channels, pointing them all towards one place, which would effectively be our site now. So that's something we're gonna to start to be doing. Uh, the third thing I, is I just want to briefly summarize the latest, um, to, to go with the theme of, of why we're vlogging, <laughs> I want to summarize the latest of how our outreach is going. So for the past few weeks, we've been doing a lot of cold email outreach to try to get new users on the platform from outside of our network. And um, initially it started off very slow. It was me finding emails, backing into emails um, from um, basically operations managers at marketing agencies. That was our initial target customer we were going after. And it was really, it took a really long time. And um, I was able to craft a more personalized message as a result, which, which was good, but things got out of, out of hand really quickly because not only was I trying to find these emails every day, which was taking a long time, sending the emails, 
and then working to follow up with those people the next day or two days later. But at the same time, finding new emails and getting more people into the funnel and into the pipeline. And that got out of hand because I wasn't properly able to manage who was clicking on our emails, who was opening the emails, engaging with us, who should I be following up with? So we had to find a very quick way of automating the process. And, and we did, we found a couple so software solutions that enable us to sequence these emails, um, help me to find emails in the first place. And so using those over the past week has, has helped us. On the other side of things, we had to start testing different sorts of messaging to see what would resonate the best. We tried four different messages having to do with starting free trial, um, uh, distributed workforce, coronavirus, um, solving specific problems with performance reviews, and they all sort of did okay. But the latest one we've been trying basically come, it's, it's very meta, it basically says, we are a um, you know software solution based in South Florida. We're looking to partner with agencies. Um, we want to make sure you have a valuable experience, and we can learn from that experience and that partnership. Oh, and by the way, we know this is a cold email and it's really weird, but give us a chance. And that's actually converted the best out of everything we've tried so far. So the update for today is basically we had been doing that. Um, last week into this week, getting a lot of responses, scheduling calls, which is fantastic, basically demos. Um, had a little hiccup yesterday, Google sort of flagged us for, um, I think it just sending to too many um, not existent emails, getting too many bounces, and they, they saw that as a problem. So we've since cleared that up and we're working to make sure that um, we're testing for validity now moving forward, so hopefully we don't have to deal with that. But um, that's that's the game plan. Basically, continue with what we're doing. Um, try to start to hone it a little bit tighter, and then focus on approaching each individual demo, each call separately, trying to convert them into being um, trial users and ultimately subscribers. So that's uh, the thinking for for the end of this week. Three things we're focusing on, basically. Um, nailing down why we're doing this vlog in the first place to help others as well as ourselves, um, creating a, a better organized content plan that will help us moving forward into the future, and cold email outreach, <laughs> trying to schedule demos, and then leveraging our newfound sales knowledge to try to convert those people. So that's it for Friday. Um, looking forward to Hopefully having a nice weekend and then uh, we have a lot of these calls coming up next week. So I'll be sure to update you then. Catch you later.